What's up guys, Ford Boy here. So today we're going to be looking at the achievement Higher Dimensional Learning. You will need two items for this achievement. The first one is the Emerald Winds toy. If you haven't received this toy yet, I have an achievement guide on how to do it. I will put it in the description below. The second thing you will need is a beginner's guide to dimensional rifting. And I will also show you how to get that before we get started with the books. So in order to complete this achievement, you will have to read seven books that are scattered throughout Azurna. The reason why it is important to have this book is because it will teleport you to a book location. Whether the book is up or not is a different matter. Nonetheless, it does have a four hour cooldown and you will want to use it on cooldown. It can only be used in Azurna, so you have to be in the zone to use the book. And I am now showing you how to do it. You simply right click on the book and it will teleport you to a location of where a book has spawned. The only downside to this book is it's going to cost you 500 gold and you have to be revered with the court of Farandus. So here we are, it teleports us to the location of where the book is. This one is up. When you teleport, you may not have a book up. So it's important to check these locations, especially when you start to collect books and you only need a select few. Alright, so chapter 1 is located right here on the edge of the map. And as you can see, all you have to do is right click and read the book on to the next one all right so chapter two you will need a glider and this is where the emerald wings toy comes in from the Deloran flight path you will have to use the toy to glide into a Zerna on top of a tower now before you get all psyched out it's not that hard simply use the toy and then equip your glider and just glide. If you have a demon hunter, you can basically just hop there um, while maintaining your flight. It's important that you get straightened out, as you can see. I'm looking at the map, making sure I'm going the right way, getting lined up, and as you look, um, you will be able to actually see the tower. See the tower, just maintain course, use the glider and the toy to float along um, as you can see I keep my glider up and use the toy as necessary to keep my altitude up you don't want to overshoot it and be too high because then you'll have to drop you don't want to be too low because then you'll miss it completely this is the only way to reach the top of the tower so you will have to do this to get the book as you can see it's right there on the map notice that I'm not using the toy as much I'm coming in a little high um, I should have backed off the toy a little bit but simply glide down onto the top of the tower and try not to miss it once you get to the top of the tower the book will be sitting on the floor right here to get down simply use the portal behind me and we're off to the next one alright for chapter 3 we are in the northern end of Azerna right here on this rock is where the book should spawn here on the map right there as you can see this is actually a questing zone so the book is going to be hard to find here alright for chapter 4 we are right there on the map and we will run through these NPCs and up the stairway. It's also important to note that when you right click on these books, they will despawn. Um, they have a several hour despawn time, so that is important to know. So when you get to the top of the stairs, right click the portal and it will teleport you to the top of the tower. When you get to the top of the tower, 
you will see there's this guy holding a book. That's not the book. That's an actual imitation of the dimensional rifting book that you have. The book should spawn right above his head. Alright guys, we're getting there. Chapter 5. We are right... Oh, we are right there on the map. And you will see a little dirt pathway leading up the side of the mountain. Follow this path all the way to the top of the mountain. Watch out for the sleeping bears at the top. Don't step on them. They are elites. And they do hurt. So anyway, follow the path all the way up the mountainside. When you come to the fallen down tree, veer left. And you will come to this ridge. The book will be sitting right there on the ridge. Alright, chapter 6. Here we are on the map right there run up the path and around the mountain and it'll be sitting right here where I'm standing on the ledge alright chapter 7 on our quest for knowledge right there on the map now you will have to run up the side of a mountain to get to the top of that tower I found it's easier to dismount and run up on foot than to actually mount up because your mount seems to get stuck. Run up the mountain as, as high as you can and then veer to the right until you reach this ledge. From here you can use your glider and emerald toy to simply glide to the other side and land on the tower. It's similar to chapter 2 just not as hard. Once you get to the top of the tower, the book will be sitting right there. And when you're ready to get down, simply right click on the portal behind me. If you guys found this video to be helpful and you guys gained some value from it, be sure to hit that like button. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so you can get notified of new videos like this, new content I'm putting out. And if you have any questions about this or anything else, feel free to comment with a question below. And I'll be more than happy to answer any questions I can. Alright, thanks guys.